What's up? This is your boy Super, and I'm playing at No Man's Sky. Sorry, Expedition Six Bladed. We're one objective away from completing Phase Two, so we're working on Phase Three because that was an asinine objective. We got to deploy a submarine to do that. You need to be on a water planet. You have to have certain resources. Which we're gonna do. What we're gonna do? We're gonna gather. Let's see if there's any water planets in this system. We've been in the system a while now, so there's one planet with water for sure. And that's it. Just that one water planet. We need to dive down deep into the water to gather crystal sulfide from around the sea vents. We need four of them. We also need salt, which is common on water planets. No planets with water. Not necessarily devoted to water. Restricted to water. Anyway. I think we're looking right at the water planet. Yes, we are. It's not really a water planet, it's a paradise planet. Paradise planets have water planets. Great barbecue out. Plenty of forest. Lots of wildlife. Lots of beautiful weather. And every gas station sells the best beer. That's where we're headed. That's where we're headed. We got some gold, got some silver. Might as well just fill up our starship's high capacity inventory, which is new to this update. And it's an awesome addition, I must say. But it doesn't make up for all the terrible modifications to the game, I must say. But here we are, right in right at the water. Let's just go ahead and land in the sky, why not? We got plenty of fuel. And if not, we can call fuel rats. Ha 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 ha! But these objects that we're looking for have a... Uh, they used to have a low spawn rate. Even if you landed on a completely water planet, you would still struggle to find them. This says that we found them immediately, but it keeps guiding us to our fucking shit. It just, it's, it's, it's bugged out. It's bugged out. It's just pointing us right at our ship and saying it's crystal sulfide. No, there's not crystal sulfide over there, stupid. Look, there's no crystal sulfide. Can you see? No, we gotta turn around again. Oh my god. So let's just skip that scanner. Armored clams give you some type of pearls. I don't remember what they're called, but they're useless. Crystal sulfide will show up. And it's got a short distance at which you can discover it. And remember that. We can't use that scanner for it either. Abysmal horror, those are pretty cool. They'll give you some goodies. There is crystal sulfide right there. See how it didn't show up until we highlighted it? And now it's got its own icon with the distance and everything. Yeah, that's the way it works. Upsetting as it may be. And now this is just like those gaseous plants that we were harvesting. You gotta keep your distance and gather these three things on the side. Cause it erupts hot ass gas from it so it'll burn you up each, each one of these vents comes with comes with bear that's how that's what happens when you get too close each one of them comes with three crystal sulfides on it luckily they're easy to see easy to harvest but the spawn rate is what's catch, as they say. Yeah, I don't want to deal with any armored clams. Don't need the money. We have 6.5 million. 
last episode, I guess, guessed we were going to have 6.3 after selling our inventory. One of those happy accidents, I guess. Yeah, see, there's, there might be one down here. Leagues under the sea, explore any units below sea. Surely there's some good things to be scanned and harvested down here. It is a biological entity. I mean, it's not a rock, it's not a plant. It's a living, breathing thing. Who's that? Glowing red thing. It's a living. It is. I didn't say much, but up there is a biological entity. Uh, oh, there's another vent. There's a vent right there, right there. And there it is showing up, too. And our one scanner got has it. Oh, they it modified your breathing. It used to refill so much faster. Like as soon as you breathe to the surface, it was like full. It slowed that down quite a bit. And there's they've increased the spawn rate of these. Look, there's two for one. You would never see two of them together, ever. But I don't like. Why would you increase the spawn rate of something so useless? I guess, uh, salt, salt should be everywhere down here. You scan all these plants and all these rocks, most of them will give you salt. There's one. There's big pickled cucumber looking things right there, give us salt. This, this also gives us salt. Our aloe vera leaf looking things, these things, these cactus leaf things. And that should be it. We can build our submarine now. Do we want to? Fuck no. Do we want to use our submarine? Fuck no. Do you know, do you know what I think about a submarine? Fuck. Who could give a fuck? Now we can replace this stupid old shit. It's gotta be way down in the bottom of the ocean. I used to be able to put it up on the beach. What, what, baby? Two feet of water, but I got a submarine. Right there. Now we gotta entry it. Ta da! On the fuel. We used to have a fuel cell. We don't know anymore. So we're gonna need some more cytophos cytophosphate. So there's two next to each other. We harvested one, we gotta get the other one and make it through. So there we go, fucking finally. Deployed the Nautilus submarine. Alright, alright. We got the marine shelter, garbage. And we've got 15 living pearls, garbage, 1600 oxygen, payday. And we've also completed leagues under the sea, reach ocean depths of 80 units. We get the diving kit, standing increased with the explorer's guild. Look at the diving kit. Underwater protection module garbage, underwater protection module garbage, salt garbage, underwater protection module garbage, I mean, pearl garbage. I don't see a diving kit, is that what it is? Maybe that's technology, no? I don't know what a diving kit is. I don't see anything new in my inventory. 
teleport. This is to teleport your gear back and forth. So we do need that crystal ball flying. We're going anywhere in the submarine. We gotta have this. Wait, town of sea. A diving kit. A diving kit must have been all three of these mods. <clears throat> So, locate the final map fragment. The book. That'll be giving me some icons. We can put that S rank one in. That goes in our suit. I would rather not have it in our suit. I would rather put it in the submarine. Can it ma match with that? No, it can't match with that. Can match with anything. No, it can't match with anything. What a waste of space. And we did get pick up a fuel unit. Where did that go? It's in our freighter. Okay, so I didn't save it. Luckily, we can just summon a freighter, I think. Yeah. You used to be able to aim right above your head. I don't see why they fucked with that. Like, who the f Okay, there we go. And nonsense, nonsensical ass changes that they're fucking making. We're still too far away, but at least we can fly to it now and get the fuel. We're going to need to at some point right here for this objective acquire an aquatic treasure. Because we need to use the submarine. I don't know how we're going to find this map fragment either. But we since we have our noddle in here prepared, we should probably place a save beacon of work. Need two metal plating, easy. Oops. Save beacon serves as an icon, you know, beacon serves as a beacon. But you can also save progress here. You can also pick it up and carry it wherever and place it wherever you want. You can also change the color of its icon, of its beacon. So desire. So our icon we're looking for should look like an exclamation point. Let's see. I can find that transform the screen. It just looks like an exclamation point where you should go, blah, 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 and it's on this planet. I just saw it. There it is. See, look at the upper left corner of the screen. There it is. I see it. Right now it's in the center. That's not it. That's it. Underwater wreck? Question mark. Okay, so we're going to need to summon our submarine from on the opposite side of the planet. And did it even explain how we can do that? Did it? No, it didn't. Can we do that? We're gonna have to land a ship on this island here. Hogwash, motherfucker. Checkpoint. Summon. No ship. Exocraft. Submarine. We we didn't get our fuel, we gotta go. Now we've got to place another fucking save beacon, dude. No, no we don't. We've got to go to our freighter for sure, though. To get that fuel cell. There we go, right up above. Now can we teleport shit? No. Fuck no. Bad boy. Ugly ass player. Looks like a giant penis.
it's nice to be home, baby. What you got cooking? What you got cooking, good looking? Yeah. Say hello to my little friend. Debrief Commander, what do you got for me? Not a damn 33,000 units. Are you serious? And oh, he's got a Grimgall pollen. Approximately 2,383 years old. Delicate plant. Okay, that's not bad. Let's go ahead and send them out again. So we should have like a quarter of a million if we sell that. Send him out on another number one. We want Voyage of Discovery or do we want Balanced? Probably want Voyage. What the fuck is going on? We probably want Voyage of Discovery. Boom, so they launch. Shoot. And we want this fuel cell. Right. Five of them. Okay. That's awesome. What is this? Other shit in here, we got Humboldt Drive, we want to take that. Let's take this out, we sold the salvage glass. We want to put the... Look at that, is that it? There was something I just saw, we want to put it in here. Salvage, Pugnium. Pugnium, we should have, oh, we sold it, we sold it, okay, yeah, that's right. Magnetized ferrite. What other types of ferrite? The magnetized ferrite can go in the radar. Mm. So we're keeping in here. Pure ferrite. We don't have any of that. Gold, silver, quantum computer emerald. Positive blah, blah, blah. Okay. Flip. Summoned it right here on the sh there it is on top of the water. The fuck's the submarine doing on top of the water? Bug number a hundred. Fucking these can go in our sub. And we can refuel it. Takes one to fill it up. That's pretty good. Oh, fuck, oh sweet And then the controls. Oh, whoa, 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 no, right is not left, and left is not left. Look, so right goes left, left goes right, up goes forward, and down goes, down spins around and goes forward. Okay. So as R2 do nothing else, it turns sharply to the right. L1 does nothing, R1. Does nothing. R2 does nothing. That's really weird that out of all the direction buttons, you have one that turns to the left and none that turn, and that's it. That's crazy. So up is cool. How do we sink down? How do we drop it like it's hot, baby? How do we, how do we drop down and get our ego on? Okay, we're starting. Maybe just aim, just aim down. They've reworked the controls. I know I talked really shitty about submarines, but I knew the controls of them. I spent hours and hours 
searching through the water trying to find crystal sulfite the things I mentioned earlier that were so hard to find with a low ass spawn right could you imagine just spending hours searching through the water and not finding anything hours and hours and hours it's fucking absurd where is the exclamation okay and the controls were a lot like Buttons were assigned for certain functions a lot more than this control scheme. Up is forward, down is forward, left is right, right is right, and use your camera to go up to increase and decrease your depth. That, that's the biggest change that I could because there was a button to lower yourself, there was a button to raise yourself, but the fucked up left and right turning scheme has system. We've got to exit and listen to this audio log. The ship's computer is badly corroded. Most of the logs are unrecoverably damaged. The dead are swallowed by the ocean. Only a smattering of clips from the final recording are intelligible. Because it's finally, no, their secret. Because it's using portals. Because it's Legends were true, cause it's not from this galaxy, because going to take the treasure back, cause it's exploit their network, cause it's tucked into a crevice miraculously intact, I find a fragment of a familiar looking star chart. Pirate map fragment tray of tray. The last piece complete each week met the final map fragment. This is one of those underwater oxygen bubble things we just got the blueprint for a while ago. So you go in here, Sarate, you can recharge your oxygen tanks. Boom shot A. And this is a dis dis uh, distress signal that it leads to a crash ship which you can own. Underwater. It's awesome. Very cool. Very cool indeed. You're a full on ferrite dust. Thank you very much. We got some dihydrogen jelly. Sodium. That sodium's a bit high right now. Thank you. Mini cheeseburgers. It's weird that blood, things with blood in it increase your sodium. And like, oh no, it's the sodium, it's the sodium. No, motherfucker, it's your drinking blood. Wake up. Vegetarians unite. Let's get some salvage down while we're here. We got a two piece. <coughs> they, they didn't give us a biscuit though. What kind of shit? We can't can't get a scan on the ship. It's stupid. It's really stupid. I have to enter it now to see what kind of ship it is. If it's an S, we can't enter it. Why can we not fucking enter the ship? Are you fucking shitting me? Are you fucking kidding? You used to be able to own these ships. Why can we not? We can't scan it. We can't enter it. Swim right through, okay. So it might be just like a reload your system type. Can we auto save when we leave the submarine. We do not, okay. Well, we completed the objectives, collect the reward. We got 4096 nanites down to the bite with precision. And just the other thing. Phase four, that was the map fragment. And one, three exosuit expansion slides. Okay, we can leave. I want to look at the ship though. We got to go back up. X, so X does raise you up. X, X does function as a jump button, I guess. Ascend. Especially Jim Cameron, anything he does underwater is fucking amazing. I know, I know, I know. I'm not a big, I don't watch many documentaries, I guess. 
he does some good stuff. We're gonna head back to our ship auto save now we're gonna go and see if we can claim we got a place a marker or something that we're not going to be able to discern what direction or where this is located at. Is there a, is there like an icon we can mark for it? There's cargo pods and deployed navigation marker, okay, and a distress beacon. Uh, it's tagged with distress beacon. Uh, well, we kind of are, our stuff, I don't know. Let's let's see if we can swim faster than something. No, no, we can't. Put it back in. can install in all types of mods just like your starship, your multi-tool, your suit. We don't have to you can probably change the color to I'm sure you can. But you can't take it on land. So we want to Auto save and reload game. It's auto save. Then when you suspend the game, the loading screen actually fucking stops. So kind of stupid ass shit. It's still better than 90% of the games out there. It is like six years old or something. Let's see if our icons are still there. Um, clam, crystal sulfide, um, clam. I bet you they're, they're in this direction. I bet you they're gone, but we can still go in this direction. Yeah, they're fucking gone. Depends what get into our sub. What is this thing? Looking like the right left thing. That's weird. Okay, it's close to something. So this is the direction. We should get on the top. can't scan it. Still swim through it. We still can't enter it. Son of a bitch. You know what? That puts me in a foul mood. It really does. I wish there was some sort of type of fucking fast track. I swear. This is underwater bullshit. As bad as it gets. It's gonna be some fucking ice. Like, I, I was literally on a, an entire a water world. They had like one every every three hours you swam through the water you found one or two islands and I was hunting for crystal sulfide and you ate of them and I couldn't find them. It went on for days. It went on for days. It's absurd. I'm glad they fixed it and they want to show you that. What to do? What does that mean? Why are you gonna be so vague? Acquire an underwater treasure. What the fuck does that mean? Acquire an aquatic treasure from an underwater rune. Use the analyst visor and the terrain manipulator to locate and excavate sealed sea chests. Those are completely new. 
The Nautilin submarine will assist underwater exploration. Use Nautilin's high-powered sonar to locate underwater objects. Purchase Nautilin upgrades from Perseus on the Space Anomaly. Install high-powered sonar. Looks like we've already got the blueprint. We've already got a, a few of the crafting materials. And the high power sonar I've already tried to install, so crystal sulfite should be easy. What sucks is you haven't, you don't, oh, this is fucking shit. I thought we were still in the submarine. We're right by crystal sulfite and we only need one. No reason to fuck fly away. But you can't use this scanner, which helps you find crystal sulfite in your snodling. How fucking ridiculous is that? You can't look for underwater items with your submarine. You have to use your exosuit. What the fuck? And, and after fucking 30 fucking plus updates and bug fixes and patches and blah, 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 and this and that. You mean I can't use the fucking underwater scanner in my submarine? I have to hop out and use my suit scanner. What the fuck is wrong with the people? We only need a one. Let's fucking go. This underwater shit is just terrible. Absolutely fucking appalling. And man, there's no excuse for it. Solar mirror. We don't have the blueprint for solar mirror. Where's my goddamn ship? I doubt we'll find one at the fucking space station either. That's why I've been collecting these technology modules where they at four of them. I don't I don't know if four is gonna buy a blueprint. We need nanites for blueprints. We have fifty three hundred nanites. Yeah we can go buy it with nanites. Just if you wanna like the game just stay away from the fucking underwater shit. It's the worst of the game. See, I try to think of it from a balanced perspective, like, you bought the game and they made it worth the money, but then they kept giving free shit and free shit and free shit, when you keep asking for free shit, shit's what you get. Like, there's no other game that can even compared to this one. I mean, besides for like indie homework type games where you think you're getting smarter just by playing it. Those types of games do. Who fucking likes those? I do, sometimes. What kind of blueprint are we looking for? Um, underwater or Nautilin, that's an exocraft. We can get a suit expansion slot and then go to the exocraft dealer. Some multi tool guys, good looking multi tool. Yeah, that's a nice one. I wish it was an S class or masculine colors instead of feminine. Solar mirror, right here. The ship shield, starship shield recharger is not a bad one either. Um, like if I was playing a game, these are must-haves as well, but. I don't know if we're gonna get that far. We still have now. Oh, I forgot we just sold some data and we still have 5,000 nanites. Let's go ahead and get all of these. It'll only cost us a thousand. There we go. Okay, now solar mirror. What do we need to make a solar mirror? What do we need? We need one solar mirror for the 
radar and sonar for our ship. We can make it already. Now we've got to fly all the way back down to our goddamn submarine. Knowing that there's many more blueprints that we should definitely be unlocking. The inconvenience and the hassle of expeditions. So the freighter should still be right above. Right, so we just have to access our subs eventually. Finish building. It's probably on the big island. It's in the lower end of our nose. Probably good. Wow, there wasn't this many the first time we were down here. There was like three tiny ones and one big one. Where is that area at? And it was right above our freighter. We can't even fucking see our freighter. There it is. Two lights right there. So, well, we can always summon it. Then we're gonna lose the location of that crash ship. Uh, yeah. Boom shawty, boom shawty. Nothing else we can add to it. Now that the high power solar is complete, we can find use it to find okay, well, the water's right here. As well, Sona treasure. Ancient ruins sometimes have treasure. Submerged ruins protected in case we should have an icon popped up. Okay, so maybe it's just a break of words. I don't know why I kept swerving to the left and right. How far away are we from this? How am I gonna know? Okay, now the up and downs work too. Right? No, the up and downs don't work. Okay. I don't even know if we can get to that by way of water. Get out of here. I'm on here. Why I'm going to ship this after this. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Look at that. He lives in the pineapple under the sea. He lives in the pineapple under the sea. Yellow and poor as the sea. Nautical nonsense be something you wish. You can drop on the deck and flop like a fish. Yeah, we got a glimpse when we went under. Okay, that makes sense. It's a submarine. Of course you got to go under. Tag it and bag it, baby, but we do need our ship. Six minutes away. Let's go. Come on. Glad we got a green fighter. And it's even as how lucky can one guy be. We don't have, okay, we got an island with two, two landing pads here. This Hungry. Fuck. There it is. 
got a tiger again? Yeah. What kind of shit? He's coming to the dividend. Don't think to the grand line that he double up to buy all my pizza fish. Come on, come on. Okay, they come to me. Okay. Dead at ass. Dead at ass. The things are going to be water ruins, I don't think. No nonsense. Let's get right to it. That's not an entrance. That's the thing we need to interact with, I'm sure. Refractive light. I hear a voice, soft, but incess insistent, growing ever louder as I linger before the ancient altar. I close closer, the water rushing about me, demanding that I listen to its tale, except the waves. Poseidon, there was no man. I went down to the beach today. There's something about the sea at this time of year that draws you in, distorts your sense of time. Salty frost on stubby grass, the sand blowing off the tops of the dunes, no one else for miles. People love the sound of waves, but it takes gray skies and high winds to really feel it. To understand their never-ending crash, the drum they beat upon the land, it makes me shiver. I pull back, and the roar of the ocean subsides. As the light of the ruin fades, I find an ancient key, perfect despite its age. Trident key, okay, I knew it was something to do with Poseidon. So that doesn't count as an ancient treasure. Is the treasure buried underneath the ruin? I don't get it. Okay, we got the key to the ancient treasure. There is a salted, a sealed sea chest. Okay, a salted sealed sea chest on the fucking seashore. Sold by Sally, I'm sure. Oops, show it eh? So we need one key and one living pearl. That's why they gave us the living pearls. This is all new. And we've got recovered treasure from a submerged ruin. Objective complete. Expedition 6, phase 3 complete. Do my goddamn sub. So three is complete easily, I'm happy to see. We got a band life support upgrade, two hypnotic eyes. I think those are pretty valuable. We can't skip the vignette for some reason. Okay, and for completing phase three, we did piracy flag plans, unity flag plans, heraldry flag plans, orbital flag plans, viridian flag plans, trash. Absolute and utter trash. Now we got just about three phases complete and we have three weeks left in the total expedition. Visiting pirate system, once we get to a certain point in this expedition, that will become super easy, I'm sure. Oh no, 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 we need a walker brain. And a walker brain's never gonna get any easier unless we, you know, we, we upgrade our weapons and we upgrade our suit to take more damage or to and deal more damage. <clears throat> Let me make a good spot for the end of this video. This has been your boy Super playing No Man's Sky, Expedition 6 Blighted. If you enjoyed it, would help me out a lot if you could like, comment, and subscribe. And see you.